Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the ASI 7305-2B double roll toilet, tish, toilet paper tissue holder. So this uh, unit is comprised of uh, three brackets. You've got your outside end here. You've got your middle, uh, middle uh, post here. Okay. Then you've got your opposite end here. Okay. Actually, I'm going to tilt the camera down to the, my workspace here. It'll be a little bit easier to show you this unit. So we've got the one end here. Okay. And then, of course, two spindles. Obviously going to look like this when it's all installed. Okay. So it's fairly large as you can see and there's a link below this video to the cut sheet which shows dimensionally everything important about it. But just to give you an idea, um, they're saying that it's 13 and a half overall and that would indeed be the case when these spindles were somewhat compressed to, to their normal mounting position. When I have the spindles uncompressed it comes out to 14 inch overall. It's a little bit hard for I know for you to see that. The um, projection, the total projection is 3 and 7 eighths of an inch. So I'm going to tilt the camera up now and be able to show you these parts individually. Okay, so three and seven eighths projection. That looks to be correct. <clears throat> the 7305 2 is representative of the fact that it's a surface mount dual roll toilet paper holder. The B means that it's in the bright finish. Okay, so this is bright stainless steel. So your components are going to be stainless steel. And then your spindles are going to be like a um, it's a chrome plated plastic spindle is what they call this. These spindles are available individually you can buy these um, which is not unusual theft and, and loss that kind of stuff. The mounting brackets are held on <clears throat> with this wall plate that you see here and the wall plate is held in with the set screw so I'm going to loosen the set screw and show you the installation aspect of this And once the wall plate, once you remove it from the unit itself, the wall plate securely fastens to the wall. Screws are not included. You'll have to provide fasteners. So these little fingers go up and opposite of the wall. And then once this is secured to the wall, you connect the post to the wall plate where the fingers are going to go into the uh, holder there and then it's just gravity uh, held at that point. So wall plates attached to the wall, post is hanging on it, and then just simply tighten up your set screw. And you need a small Allen wrench for doing that. And once you've got that securely fastened, it's 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 good to go. It's going to stay right where it is. Your two, uh, all three of your posts feature the set screw principle. Okay. And uh, the mounting pad dimension I didn't mention earlier is two inch by two inch, which is a common size for a lot of items like this, coat hooks and etc. Two inch by two inch. If you have any questions on the ASI 7305-2B, uh, bright stainless steel double roll toilet tissue holder or any other ASI product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you very much.